What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. As Samsung has started rolling out a brand new update for the Samsung Galaxy S22 series. This is the S22 Ultra I've got here and this has got the brand new security patch for October 2024. Now you might have already got the update for the Galaxy S22 series or you might be waiting for it. Uh, in my region, I have just received the update so I thought why not keep you guys posted about this. Uh, let me just go to the settings over here. Let me tap on software update and tap on download and install. You see, we have got the security patch for October 2024. You can see the size is about 429.16 MB and the uh, WiWi version 6.1 and 14. And the version number ends with AEXJ1. And we have got a standard change log over here. It says device stability improvements and bug fixes, new or enhanced features, further improvements to performance. There's no new feature which is being added here, but if you have been facing any kind of bug, or any battery drain issues or any sort of issues on the phone the update should fix those issues so make sure you update the device let me just resume the download here it's going to take a few minutes to update this and i will get back to you guys let's do our usual tests with app opening test the animation test and let's see if there are any stutters or any issues let me go ahead and tap on install now all right, now the device has been updated. Let me quickly show you that. Let me show you the last update. As you can see, this is the October patch which has been installed on the device. Now let's go ahead and uh, open a few applications. Let's see if there is any lags or stutters here. Phone application, gallery, play store, internet, clock. Now let's go to the recent application. Or running smoothly without any issues. Now let me just close this up. Let's go to the quick panel. No stutter or lags on the quick panel as well. Let me press and hold on the home screen. This phone is running as smooth as a brand new phone. In fact, my wife has been using this phone as a primary device and she has not been facing any sort of issues on the phone. She's quite happy with this. This is already a two year old phone. And even today it is running very smoothly. Even the battery performance has been great. Slightly more than one day if you use it moderately. If you use it heavily, you are gonna get about a day of battery life, which is still pretty good on this two year old device. Now let's go ahead, let's open Galaxy Store here. Let me tap on menu and tap on update let's see if there are any new updates as you can see we have got the samsung capture uh, update here which is the smart select feature and we have got a couple of other updates for samsung cloud and samsung notes let me tap on uh, samsung capture now we have already discussed about this update in my previous videos we have got a few new features new enhancements and we have got the gif back on the device as you can see it says you can uh, now create animations or gifs uh, the pin feature is now available directly from the toolbar after selecting an area. You can now drag the selected area to adjust the position. The touch range has been modified to make it a little easier to adjust the selected area. Now all these enhancements we have already discussed in my previous video. So if you missed that, go ahead and check those out on the channel. Now for the S22 series, we have got this update with all these new features and enhancements for Samsung Capture application. Let me just quickly tell you which one is it. This is the Samsung Capture. This got revamped with One UI 6.1 uh, uh, AI upgrade that we got. And for this, we have got more enhancements and the GIF feature has been added back. Now let's go to the uh, settings and let's go to security settings here. Security and privacy. Let me tap on updates. Here the Google Play system update is showing July 2024. Let me tap on this and let's check the uh, Google Play system update. I think we have got the latest update here. Let me tap on restart now. It did not show me the update details for some reason. It just asked me to restart the device. Let's see whether we have got the September security patch update on this or not. All right, now the device has been restarted. Let's go to the settings. I'll go to the security and privacy tab again. Let's tap on update section here. Yeah, we do have September Google Play system update right here. As you can see, the device has been updated to the latest September Google Play system update. So these updates are really important. Even the security patch as well as the uh, Google Play system update is quite important for your device. Uh, these fixes a lot of bugs and it will also improve the security of the device. So you must go ahead and download these updates, not just the security patch from Samsung. You should also update your Google Play system every month. Now the October month is delayed. Uh, it is not available yet. Generally, we get the current month's update on the subsequent month and the previous month's update in the current month. That is what has been the case 
case with uh, respect to Google Play system update, you must check the update every month and install it. Now you guys let me know whether you have got all these updates. Have you got the smart select feature uh, update already? Have you got the security patch? Have you got the Google Play system update? Drop a comment and let me know. And while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.